Here we have a slab situation where the feet are far apart. One is much higher than the other. And because of that, your hip is going to have trouble getting on top of your foot, meaning you're going to be tempted to use these holds to create balance and create force to move you up the wall rather than good technique. But since you're watching these videos, you're not going to do that. You're going to use the best technique possible. And here's how you do it. Your bottom foot on this hold is the most important foot, the most important part of this climb. When I get into position, if I have my, the ball of my foot on the hold in a comfortable spot, you can see it actually puts my foot behind my toe, or sorry, my hip. It puts my hip behind my toe, making it difficult to get up, making me have to use this hold here. And that forces me to barn door off the wall. But if I can go up on my tiptoe, get my toe as extended as possible, it will push my hips higher, they'll be able to go on my foot, and now I'll be in a more powerful, better leverage position to use my hip and my thigh. Let's try it again. Up on my toe, hips come up, and now even with one finger, I can get up the wall in good balance. When I learned this trick, it made a huge difference to my slab climbing, and I know it will help yours. Give it a shot. Thank you.